Hey everybody, Johan Magnuson here, Big Sweet Barbecue, and today we're cooking up something really luxurious and extremely tasty. Today we're making an A5 Wagyu ribeye with foie gras on the artiflame. So the first thing that we wanna do is light up the artiflame, and here's how I do that. We're gonna start by filling up a chimney starter completely with some charcoal. Then we wanna light it on fire using a couple of fire starters. And when we see plenty of flames on top of the chimney starter, it's time to dump the charcoal into the artiflame. Now we can add sticks of wood to build an even better fire. Now when the artiflame plancha is heating up, it's time to start preparing all the ingredients. And here's how we do that. We're gonna start by placing a saute pan on the plancha. Then we're gonna add one tablespoon of butter and let it melt. Next, we wanna add one large shallot that we finely diced. Now we wanna saute this for a couple of minutes until translucent. Then we wanna add one garlic clove finely minced. Next, we're gonna add three quarters of a cup of really good beef demi-glace. And then we wanna add half a bottle of port wine. Now we're gonna let this reduce over heat until almost syrupy. Then we need to season it with a little bit of salt and pepper and set aside. Next, we're gonna cut some smaller porcini mushrooms into halves. Then we wanna season them on one side with some thyme salt from Saltberg. We're gonna add some olive oil to the plancha. Then we're gonna add the porcini mushrooms to the grill. And now we wanna grill these until brown and thoroughly cooked through. When ready, remove them from the grill. The sauce is ready, the porcini is ready. The last thing that we need to do is prep the ribeye and the foie gras, and here's how we do that. We got a beautiful A5 Wagyu ribeye Hokkaido district from Second City Prime. The only thing we're gonna do to this is season it with a little bit of thyme salt from Saltberg. We also wanna carefully score a large slice of foie gras and season with a little bit of the thyme salt as well. Now we're gonna place the A5 Wagyu ribeye on the artiflame plancha, and we wanna sear this for a couple of minutes, making sure that we flip the ribeye frequently. When the ribeye is almost ready, we wanna add the foie gras as well. And then we're gonna quickly sear the foie gras, maybe 20 seconds on each side. Then we're gonna remove both the ribeye and the foie gras. Now it's time to plate it, and we wanna start by plating a little bit of the port wine reduction sauce on a plate. Then we're gonna place the A5 Wagyu ribeye in the sauce. And next, we wanna place the foie gras on top of the ribeye. We're gonna crown this masterpiece with some of the porcini mushrooms. Last but not least, we also wanna add a little dollop of red currant jelly. And then this beautiful dish is ready to serve. And that is how I make my A5 Wagyu ribeye with foie gras on the artiflame. And I think the only thing left to do is to try this. I'm gonna slice up a little piece here, get some foie, get some sauce, get a porcini on there. Uh, there we go. Look at that, that just looks amazing. Oh. <laughs> so rich, so flavorful. It almost feels decadent to eat this. This is really good. I hope you try it at home. Happy grilling. <laughs>